So this was the first thing I saw and I was like, what am I looking at? <laughs> like, what? <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> Seriously, I was like, what is this? What is going on? What am I looking at? Uh, so this is a very early build, right? Like, things are still... Th there's art? There... Hold on. So... This was the thing that, that hooked me. And I was like, okay. Uh, I think none of this stuff is active. So Wesker's over here with his jubilee doobly. Uh, he's, he's, he's hugging his Ouroboros out. He might make out with it later. Chat room, the artwork in this game is friggin' sick. <laughs> All right, I feel I feel weak that I was interested in this game just by looking at this. I'm like, okay, all right. What else is going on? What else is this game about? So, I kind of want to go through and just look at some of the artwork first before before we actually like try to figure out how to play the game. Um, so hold on a second. Uh, what do I have to do? I think it's under. If there's translation things, it's not done. Uh, so, the idea is that you pick a character, and your character has, like, from what I understand, different sets of attributes and abilities, like shadow. I think this one is, like, darkness. This one is speed, and maybe this one's power. I don't know. We're gonna figure it out. Uh, the uh, chat, chat room's already on, on, on the same level as me. I'm like, is this sort of a precursor towards future Capcom games? Hmm, is this sort of a, is this, what is this? So, you switch to Ryu. I won't let the Satsui no Hado consume me. Okay, actually got Ryu's voice actor. That's interesting. What about Chun-Li? Did they get, uh, did they get Laura Bailey, who I think did Chun-Li before? Father, I'll put an end to their plans. Maybe, maybe that's, maybe that's, Chun Li's voice actor, and then the big one. When I scroll down, this was when I first saw the game, right? I was like, okay, can I crank the volume because there was no volume on any of this stuff, and I was like, I need to listen to this. The first one I was looking at was you could play Wesker, and I'm like, now the question is, did they rehire Wesker's voice actor? Did they rehire uh, DC Douglas? Hold on, one second, one second, to make sure you can actually hear it, chat. The right to be a god. That right is now mine. And I don't know if they're reusing the assets or they got completely new voice actors, but I'm I'm guessing I'm guessing our new new actually had them record lines, but they're actually having everyone that's played these characters over the past like 10, 15 years reprising their roles. It sounds new. And it sounds like modern DC Douglas. I'm like. Hmm. Okay. And then, of course. The big one. My soul is screaming. For your head, that is. That is definitely Ruben Langdon as Dante. Um, and for some reason, Dante looks like this. And this was immediately where I was like, I, I even asked them. I was like, why does Dante have his, his, uh, why is he definitely cry for? Like, what happened? This mu And this, I realized this must have been in development for a long time. Because now we have Capcom games where Dante has predominantly been DMC3 Dante for a long time. And everyone wanted it to be DMC4 Dante, and by the time Devil May Cry, Devil May Cry 5 came out, everyone likes DMC5 Dante now, but then another game comes out and it's DMC4 Dante, I'm like... What the hell is going on? And then the big question, chat room, the most important one of them all... The hardest voice actor to get for the entire game. Uh, and I, I, it was actually impossible because it was from the first game's release back in like 2005 or something like that. Did they get the Rathalos voice actor? Yes, they did. Wow. <laughs> they got they got Rathalos's voice actor. They actually they actually did it. What is this? So this is a um action card game. It's Capcom themed action card game, and I can't even tell you much else about it because I don't have the information. Um, it's being it's being sent to select streamers and people that are like either Capcom fans or fighting game fans or trading card game fans, from what I understand. And we're all just trying to check out what the hell's going on. I am very oh yeah, let's actually see what X sounds like. I haven't I haven't listened to this yet. Why do I fight? The answer is out there somewhere. That is significantly better. It could it could even be the 
the voice actor for X in Marvel Infinite, just done in a different way. He has Art Tank. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be Heart Tank. Um, X looks kind of weird. Like, I think he looks cool, but he looks like... That is a unique design. That is a weird design for X. Why do I fight? The answer is out there. Somewhere. It's kind of a weird design for him. Interesting. Like, I like it, but he looks very alien, right? Like, I don't know if I love it, but I don't think it's bad. It's weird. It's weird. Uh, and I haven't actually listened to uh, Morgan yet. I appreciate a good thrill. Not bad. Not bad. That is very Morgan-like. There's a lot of movement going on over here. Uh, yep, that's uh, that's Nergigante as well. Uh, it definitely is. Uh, so I'm, I think I'm gonna be, I think I'm gonna be hella basic on this. Uh, their eyes. What did Morgan's eyes look like? My soul is screaming. Damn. Yeah, Dante looks. Dante looks better. Dante looks better than. Marvel Infinite for sure. I this Ryu is godlike. <laughs> Can we get an actual Capcom game? Like, an actual, like, big Capcom fighting game with the Ryu that looks like this? Please. Uh... So they've obviously done a very good job with the artwork, right? Like, they've obviously done a, a damn good job at making these characters and their representations sound and look good. And like I said, this is where I was like, alright, you have me interested. Um... But... It's not just that, so... It's it's a card game, and here's the part where I was like, Whoa! Stuff is happening! Um, but there's, like, artwork throughout this entire game that is, like, brand spanking new artwork made for all these characters, dude. I don't know if some of these have been from other things, but... it. I think some of it's new. I think the majority of it's new. Yeah, I, I mean, I'm pretty sure this is going to come out on mobile platforms. I can't tell you exactly what. Uh, this is like an early, an early test build. There's actually like new artwork in here. Why is the text all glitchy? Because it's not a finished game yet. <laughs> it's not, it's not done. Uh... What the hell? They put Lucia in here? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, excuse me? They remembered Lucia exists? And she looks dope? What? <laughs> uh, devoting her life to the protection of her clan, she pertly, she, uh, damn it, that expertly wields twin blades to carve up demons. I wish the, so unfortunately some of the text is messed up because it is early. What does BB Hood look like? That's not bad. Looks okay, I'm not freaking out about it though. This was the dude from Mega Man X4, right? Nobody else remembered her? Regina? I haven't- I don't know if I've seen Regina in here yet. Uh... This is- this is Hearthstone? Okay, well, you're gonna have to- you're- If that- then that's good, then maybe you can actually help me out with this, because I have no idea what I'm doing. Like, I think things look cool, and I wanna- I wanna collect, like, cards and stuff, and get cool-looking shit. Wow, that is a decent rendition of Sean. But I have no idea what I'm doing. I have no idea. Is this... Toby Kadachi? It is, wow. Squirrel Viper. This guy! If this guy's in the game, then Strider has to be in here, right? They put Axel in this thing, then Strider has to be in here. Uh... Wait, who the hell? Forest? What? <laughs> you put in Forest? Was Forest the one that you kill at the beginning of RE1? I think it is. This one's shiny. I wonder what the heck that means. This one's super shiny. Yeah, Forrest, I mean, Forrest dies in RB1, right? Uh... Yes. Is What's Shadowverse? I actually... If you were like, if you were to tell me I got sponsored by Shadowverse, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. This thing is ugly. Uh... This looks like Napalm Man, but it's something different. Leon! Uh, wow, so it's RE4 Leon? Good. That's good. RE4 or RE2 Leon. Dan's over here. Okay. Where is the Nemesis card? I don't know, we're just, we're looking right now. I haven't actually looked at, I just, I'm just admiring the damn artwork. 
What the hell? This is Street Fighter 1 Ryu uppercutting the hell out of SF1 Sagat and giving him the, the scar of humiliation? All right. All right. All right. Okay. Yeah, the letters are missing because this is a work in progress. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll reiterate again. What we're looking at is a game called Project Battle. If that's the full title, I don't know. I'm not even too... It's, it's, a, it's a Capcom-themed trading card battle action game. But it is... It doesn't have a release date. There's not in much information about it right now. Uh, and people are saying... people. Are, I'm not saying this because people are like... I've never played Hearthstone or anything, but people are saying it's similar to Hearthstone. All I can tell you is that it requires, like, movement. Like, it requires timing and movement with, with some of the, the combat. And... or when you actually start having cards fight each other. And I was like, okay, that, that's actually kind of interesting, but I don't know exactly how it works, so I want to learn today. And hopefully have you guys maybe teach me something, because I... If these, what are they called, TCG games, or trading card games, if they all work sort of similar, then you're probably going to know a lot more than I do, because I've never, I've never done this. Um, but, yo, damn, the artwork, though. Damn, the presentation, though. It was obvious that they, they put in a lot... Is Zenogre over here? Is this Zenogre? No. Is it? Whoa, oh, I was looking at it wrong. I'm like, is that his face? I think that is an ogre. Holy shit. Rate the artwork? Uh, that's a lot of artwork to rate. That's a, that's a lot. So you see how this one over here... Wait a minute, let me actually look. Uh, so you have Guile. Deals three damage to an enemy unit. Okay, what does this do? Why does this one shiny, though? Reap 20? What does that mean? Oh, okay. Okay, so it has it has some modified stats to it. Okay, so you get shinies or whatever. I don't know what the hell they're called. I'll show you the gameplay. I I, I actually let me let me embellish myself with the artwork and the presentation because that's the stuff that impressed me the most when I first saw this. Is this all just reused deck? Maybe I don't know. We'll have to figure it out. Holographics, right? Um, dude, I want them to make this into a re- like, a physical thing. Like, can I get cards that actually- I won't even- I, I won't even play the game. I'm not gonna have my big, crazy battle spear around my arm and go fight people at a local comic book shop. I don't care. I just want to look at the cool pictures. In super high resolution, in physic- in card form- in pog form. Uh, ladies in here, yeah. Looks good. What the hell is that thing called, chat room? What is the giant boomerang thing that Yugi has on his stupid arm? What is that? Why does he have that? Why is it so big? I have many questions. That's very classic Resident Evil art, but it's not original Resident Evil art. It's it's new. A dual disc! It should be called a flamberjamber! I'm done. No more Yu-Gi-Oh talk. Oh, so Ken looking like he came straight out of Street Fighter 4. Like, straight out of it. Ooh. Hopefully this guy shows up in Monster Hunter uh, Iceborne. Oh my god! A man atoning for his sins. This is my favorite Darkstalkers character. Finds new meaning in life upon meeting a young girl and vows to protect her future. Jojo man protecting, protecting the little girl. Yeah, Donovan's my favorite Dark Soccer's character. Uh, damn, dude. Okay. I'm, I don't think I've ever seen that artwork for, for Donovan before. What the hell? Overdrive Ostrich? He was from Mega Man... X2? I think. Uh, this list card list keeps going. Shinketsu Hado? Uh, alright. He was from X2, yeah, I'm sorry, chat. I, I didn't play X2 a whole bunch. Uh, you'll have to fill me in on what that is. Lagiarchus? I have no idea. I need, I still need to learn all these mons that I have not ever fought. Anjanath? Oh, Barrel Bomb. So you have things that are like character cards, and then you have action cards like uppercuts or fireballs. This one is a character card. This one is a. Literal, literally grenade ammunition, entrusted ammo, deals maybe pierce damage to an enemy unit. 
Uh... What? This is... Wow. BB Hood's Marvel 2 Super. Or technically Darkstalkers 3. Uh... Wow, okay. Where's the Jill's? Yeah, there should be a... There should absolutely be a Jill Sandwich card. It should be a healing card or something like that. It's a weapon. It's really powerful. This artwork, though. Dude, I'm telling you... My interest levels in this game would not have been nearly... Would, would not be nearly to the point which I'd be interested in streaming it, unless you saw this. And I was like, this looks really good. It sounds really good, too. The battle music seems... I can't remember what the battle music was. It might have been temporary, but we'll see. I actually don't know. That, now that I'm thinking about it, the battle music... This, this theme was unique, but the battle music, I don't... Maybe it's old themes, maybe it's new themes. We actually maybe get to hear them. Anyway, let's keep going. Oh my god, Dual Dragon Hotto? This is cool, man. As someone who really likes Capcom characters and just wants them to see together in a game, this is cool. Damn. Damn, Claire is now nine feet tall. She grew four feet. <laughs> Somewhere in between RE2 to where we're currently at. Leon's knife? Now, this is a different Leon card, what the hell? Is there a Captain Commando card? I don't know, dude! I have- I'm still- we're still going. There's a QB card, so you would think that there's a Captain Commando card somewhere in there. Yeah, that's Sagato, right? Look, there's hundreds of cards in this game. That's a lot of artwork, dude. Like, that's a- They put a- they put a lot of money into the presentation of this, which I- I appreciate. I like seeing all these characters that are like, What the hell is going on down here? This one is animated, yo! Uh, sort of. I mean, it is. It's moving. It's a lot different than this one. Uh, so this one just must be super beefy. I don't know. Yeah, that's kind of neat. And it's Street Fighter V Sakura. This is like younger Sakura, and this is like eSports Sakura. Okay. It's a legendary? Okay. I guess that would make sense because it's literally glowing and moving. They longs in it. So the difference is that we're looking at playable cards, but there's also, like, characters. Like, so you have your character, and your character does... I'm not even kidding you, I've only seen about one or two of these. But your character does supers. And there's there's actually animation for supers and stuff like that. So I haven't seen all of them, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to see if we can figure out how to do them, because I don't know. Um, but the characters have, like, yeah, big flashy super animations, like... I think I saw Rathalos, like, flying up and then blasting the ground with fire, and then it lit, everything was on fire and it went away. I was like, whoa, holy shit. Is that like Gwent? Okay, I don't know. I don't know. Admittedly, I have no idea. I mean, I'm oogling over... over the things we usually oogle about chatroom, which is like classic Capcom artwork and stuff. That is QB, all right. That one's okay. Great to super. Well, we'll have to see. I don't know. There's an ogre. There's another Zenogre card in here, so there's like multiples of the same character. What is this, uh, Enrico? Wow. He's, he's been shot. This card can't be that good, right? If he's already been shot, then it can't be that great. Uh, you can click on the picture to see art without borders? Oh my god! You're... Thank you. How the hell... How the hell do you know that? <laughs> I just started this and no one else has it. Maybe maybe there's other people that have been doing that. Uh, thank you. Bro tips. So there's a lot of this Mega Man X4 guy. Holy shit, man. 10 defense? That seems pretty high. <laughs> there's a dev in the chat. There's a dev in the chat. Mod that guy, right? Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, Justin Wong was streaming. I think K Brad was streaming it. Some some of the FGC guys did have it, so it's somewhere out there. I'm a, I'm a complete noob. I want to look at this one. Holy hell! This is all like I have to remind you, chat. If you see if you see errors in type text or type, it's all work in progress. Uh, that's a good picture. Different style. Where's that BB Hood one? This art looks really familiar. Who was the guy that did the art for Third Strike? Um... Is this a fan-made game? Probably not. This is not... cheap. 
This is, uh... This would take a lot of effort to make unique artwork for every single card. And not have it be like... The, the easiest thing they could have done was just put in, like, artwork from other games. And just put it on there. Artigem? I think that's what his name is. Maybe it is. I wonder if he did... It wasn't Ikeno. I think... I think it was Artigem. Hmm... That might be him. Storm Pornade? Run on the card stats to see if they list an artist. Uh... Oh, it does! Oh shit, but it's the, the glitch... Uh, the text glitch is in there right now. Hold on a second. Uh, let's go back to... No, I guess not. Damn, I actually can't read who it is because it's not maybe fully translated yet or there's a weird pre-release bug. Uh, but damn, dude, I love this design for Ryu. My god. Like, wandering sam samurai Ryu. Other streamers don't have those letters missing? Weird! Um, maybe I'll try resetting the whole thing. And then we'll figure it out. Maybe we'll try that. Yo, what's up, Project Red? How's it going, man? Yeah, if other streamers had it not missing, I'll check. Maybe I have to, like, do the whole thing. Are you playing on an emulator? I'm pretty sure it's an emulator, because it, it, this, I'm pretty sure, is going to be a mobile game. And the app that they had me just downloaded on, um, might be emulating it weird? I'm actually not too sure. Anyway, let's keep going. There's a Rathian. Oh, God. Okay, so the uh, the guys just got a hold of me, and they we, there's already a fix for it. Hold on a second, I really want to see this card. Oh my God, dude, can I get this on a poster? <laughs> Look, they gave for you a scarf? <laughs> Jesus. Um, oh. Okay, apparently it's an easy fix. Hold on a sec. Apparently there's an easy fix. Uh, remember where we're at, chat room? We're at, we, we need artist names, so we're gonna figure out who the artist names are. Uh, let me, let me reset this entire thing. And they, they sent me a fix. So, uh, I'm gonna kill it real fast. And they want me to change one setting, and we can actually see who the artists are, because I would love to give them shoutouts, man. Like, I, I, like, I legitimately really like some of the character designs in this game. Um, Bink. Pray to God this works. Pray to God this works, chat. Is Bluestacks an emulator? Okay. They were just like, use this. Alright, changing one setting. They're like, OpenGL might work better. Um... So chat, how the hell... If, if this does come out and it's like a full... If it doesn't, like, I don't know if it's coming out on Steam or whatever, like... If it is a full mobile game, how the hell do you stream this stuff? Does anyone know? I have an iPhone, and that's probably bad, but I do have a... Like a Samsung, like, tablet. Uh... And that's what I'm curious about, Dynamic Night. Yeah, I don't know if this is gonna be, like, a PC game, or console, or just mobile, or, or what. It's probably just gonna... It's probably gonna be mobile for sure, because it obviously looks that way. Through an emulator or air server. Oh, okay, so you can actually... There's Android emulators. Oh, okay. So is that what the bigger card streamers actually do? Because this is the f chat. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna be brutal honesty. Last time I streamed a mobile game was friggin' Flappy Bird, and I loved it. It was a highly engaging experience. Um, we'll have to check that out later. When is the FF7 playthrough? I'll have an update for you later today. We'll talk about that a bit later. You guys remember Flappy Bird? I got to like 150? I was a god. I was a flapping god. Uh... Uh, it looks... It looks like stuff is working. Uh... What were we looking at? Ryu, right? Yeah, everything's working! Okay. That worked. Thank you, guys. Uh, they actually sh shot me over a hotfix really quick, so... Um... 
Yeah, Wesker looks dope, right? Look at this. Listen My to- My soul is screaming. The right to be a god. That right is now mine. Why do I fight? The answer is out there somewhere. Dude, the VO is good. <laughs> I won't let the Satsui no Hado consume. The VO is actually good. Please look up Flappy Fighter. Oh, I've seen it, Psycho. It's awesome. I've never actually had a chance to play it, but it's actually pretty cool. Anyway. I think I was doing Ryu deck. I won't let the Satsui no Hado consume me. Uh... Begin scrolling. Oh god, it has to load every single card. Yeah, X looks like a... He looks... I'm not super sold on X's- well, speaking of which, let's just fire this up. I'm not super sold on X's design, but I don't hate it. I actually think it's kind of awesome. He looks different, but I, I think his face looks really friggin' cool. So who is the artist? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ikula? <laughs> Never heard of that person before, okay. Um... Oh god! That's Felicia, alright! Yup! Francis Tenna? Hmm. hmm. Wait, is that Felicia? Wait! Wait! No, yeah, it's Felicia. That's definitely Felicia, alright. Uh, through... Born into... Though born into darkness, she never loses faith in coexistence of her dream of becoming a pop star. That's Felicia, alright! He's been that way forever. Damn, dude. Scenes he doesn't recognize flashes before his eyes. Even now, the warrior questions the purpose behind his power. X has got a weird design in this game. There's a lot of different artists. Holy shit. Okay, go back up, go back up. Where the hell? Where were we? Oh my god, there's too many cards. I see Elena. I see green herbs. What am I fighting for? Uh... Good god. There it is. Okay, so that was the last one we were looking at. This is what I wanted to check out. Who is the artist for this one? There's a lot of different artists, but they, it seems that the 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 art design was consistent. Like, very painted style, very colorful painted style, which I appreciate. Because damn, man. You saw a Tigrix card? There's actually been multiple Tigrix cards. Like, we've seen like three. Damn. Damn. That is badass, dude. You can filter cards by color with the buttons at the bottom of the screen. You are totally right. You are totally right. I'm oogling right now, okay, Chad? I'm sorry. This one looks very anime. Artist pin. So it's like uh, engulfing Hado. Seven attack, no defense. But it's weird, like, some of these cards... Like, some of them are effects. I'm already noticing, like, gameplay stuff. Some of them are... Like, moves, or effects, or healing items, or something like that. While others are, like, actual character cards, and they have defense... And, like, ratings, but they also have attack and defense, so... Apparently, like, to me right now, there's two different classes of cards. There's, like... There's, like, spells, yeah, is that what they technically are? There's, like, spells, and then there's, like, character cards. So I'm guessing the spell cards modify the character cards? Spells and mobs, okay. Top left is a cost, gotcha. Oh, so you're gonna have like, like, action points or something that'll take this, okay. This is what I've been- this is why I'm glad you guys are here, because I have no idea. Like, I have no idea how this- I'm Don't be- don't be like Max, please, okay? The la- The last trading card game I played was Triple Tryout on FF8. Don't you give me any shit. I actually want to learn. It looks pretty. I want to learn, okay? It looks interesting. Am I going to become the very best? Like, Yu-Gi-Oh! never was? No. I don't... I just want to have cool shit happen. <laughs> uh... Sorry. Oh, God. Oh, God. Did I screw it up? I screwed it up. There we go. What is this Makoto? That's pretty sick. Please, chit. 
But the, I will say, yeah, I like fighting games, I like action-y things, and I'm like, whenever I see people playing card games, they're just like... They're like, yeah, you're like playing chess, right? They're like taking their time, and they're clicking a button, and they're doing this, and they're doing that. The thing they first told me about this game, and they're like, why you might like it, is... The matches generally are three to five minutes. And I've seen a dude play a Hearthstone game that takes forever! And I'm like, how do you... It's pretty fun to watch, okay. Um, not if you play how I play. So they said, like, the average fight time is about the same length as, like, a Capcom arcade experience, between three to five minutes. So I'm like, huh. Is that not common? Is, is do card games usually last, like, a longer period of time? Three to five is stupid fast? Okay. I don't know. I don't know what three turn meta is. I don't know what an average TCG game time is. I couldn't tell you. The usual TCG match is 10 to 20 minutes. That's a commitment. So you're maybe getting two matches an hour? Jeez. How the hell are you supposed to do that on a mobile phone? Yeah, how do you commit to, like, a 10 to 20 minute thing on a mobile phone? If you're like, I need to stop what I'm doing now, and then do something else. In bed? Okay, well there you go. People play mobile games at home? <laughs> I'm new to this, okay? I don't know what's going on! Uh, a bus ride, yeah, that'll do it. Most card games are on PC, not mobile, gotcha. I actually, I actually did not know if Hearthstone was on PC or not. If it was like a mobile game, or just a PC game. What is Baroth doing? What is happening to you, Baroth? Uh, something crazy. With visibility impaired, the gargantuan form approaches, drawing closer with each thundering step. What is back there? Holy hell. X protecting some, uh, funky bots. Whoa. What was her name again? Mega Man X4? Iris! Oh man. I had to remember because I had to remember Zero's voice lines. Honey? Pretty funny. It's Copy X? What? Iris! Iris. Ugh, Hugo, hi. Hello. Iris! That's gonna be stuck in my head all night. Um... Damn! Look at X's toned ass! <laughs> wow! He got upgraded! <laughs> John Talbane's in this game, chat room. <laughs> they, uh... John Talbane. It's, but it's not him! It's an, it's an action. It's his beast charge, so... Or, 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 or John Talbane made it into this game. They didn't forget he existed. Someone remembered somewhere. Someone somewhere. Of course, Chris made it in. Seen Chris, you've been in a couple of too many things. Oh God, Toxic Elena ruining Street Fighter Four still to this day. Thank you, lady. Wow, Riku and his children. <laughs> what? Um, she is strangely attractive for a fish woman. Is the Ikula again. Fish boy needs some pants though. Swear to God. Uh, Aulblath? Uh, Aulblath? It's a cute picture. Holy shit. That's actually a really cool shot. This looks like this guy got stuck in near Automata's world or something like that. Suda Jiro? I haven't seen that one. Was that Kyrie? Oh my god, it is! Kyrie is a card? <gasps> Get back inside now! They make Kyrie into a card. How? How did Kyrie get a... You don't even see her in Devil May Cry 5. Okay, sure. But they, they had a Lucia card, chat room. That's all I'll say. They actually had a Lucia card. Uh, Arzuros? Wow, there's a- there's a bear Monster Hunter Pokémon? Simmons is gonna love killing this thing if it shows up in World. Lucia is a cool character. I will- I- I do agree. 
Lucia was in the wrong game. Just similar to everyone else that was in Devil May Cry 2. They were in the wrong game. Uh, but I always thought her design looked neat. Another Makoto card. Shiny Makoto. <laughs> the feline. Who the... Wow, it's bubble crab. Man, that looks nuts. They commissioned... Or either they commissioned or they hired a ton of artists for this game. Like an absolute ton. And I don't know if you're noticing, chat room, but they've, all, all the artwork is consistent. Like, this would be a big art book. All the artwork is consistent throughout all the cards, so it all visually looks kind of similar. Like, they actually did have a decent amount of, like, art team. Armadillo looks neat. Focusing behind all this stuff. Jetty. X has a lot of cards in here. Straight green herb. Is this for iPhone? I can't, I don't know, I can't tell you. It's, it's like a, it's like a secret game. Only thing I can tell you is that it's called Project Battle and it's, it, it is, it is going to be a thing eventually, but they're letting select people just check it out with their audiences. And they gave it to me because they knew I have a lot of people that like Capcom games. So, I'm gonna learn how to play it eventually, chat, but there's, there's quite a few stuff, there's quite a bit of stuff I really want to check out in here. The hell? Oh, wow. Uh, what is your name? Mega Man, Mega Man, what is her name? Oh, this is just gonna be a... This is just gonna be... Uh, Al Al Ali Alice? Aaliyah? Is it Aaliyah? Ugh. I'm gonna delete that card. See if I can get rid of it. Becky looking confused as usual. Iris has two cards. Feline has two cards as well. Wow, they gave one to Abel. I will play the game eventually, okay? Chat, hold on a second. Sitsiaku's over here. Shut up. R Richard's gonna get poisoned. <laughs> Help me, I'm, I'm gonna get poisoned. He may fear death, he may be injured, but as long as he can move, he'll do everything he can to protect his team and then eventually die. <laughs> Not that I don't. I'm assuming this card isn't going to be that useful. He's going to get bit by a snake and then die. Oh, there's the snake. Oh shit, Becky, look out. Uh, that's terrifying. Uh, you do not look like you're prepared for battle. Oh, it actually says she's not prepared for battle. Maybe this is a mega defense, low offense card. Okay, okay. I want to see the gameplay too, but we're still scrolling through artwork, okay? I like the artwork. Shut up, chat. We have plenty of time, all right? I don't have to end this stream in 15 minutes or anything. So, Credo's in it, that's cool. Uh, Aaliyah again. Damn, that's a badass shot of Chun. Uh, how does Kyrie have two cards? Kyrie has two cards? Why? Wow, Felicia! Wait, is that Felicia? Wait a minute. Yeah, that's Felicia, all right. Definitely is. That is definitely a Darkstalkers character. Uh, from Vyacheslav Safranov. That's definitely Felicia. Christopher is going to shoot you dead in the face. That's actually a really cool shot of Chris. Is that from the same guy? Nope. Bunch of different people. Geef looks absolutely insane. Looks like a toy. Karen's in here. Huh. Why do old Geef's cards showing his friggin' back? Oh, is this... I was about to say, Elder Dragon BS. Uh oh, Sasquatch made it in the game. There's a chance. There, there's a chance. Chat room. Who the hell? I don't like Rajang already. Why is Chris every? Oh, animated Christopher. Holy hell, dude. Kind of awesome. 
Kind of badass. So this is a so him without a gun. Why is he smiling? Because he's thrilled. He's so happy to be messing up these monsters. The Cali made it in the game. Robot General. There's a lot of X cards, and X has a crazy design. That is a badass piece of picture of Alex. When do we get to download this? I wish I could... I, dude, Jarum, I wish I can give you details, but there's literally nothing. The only thing that they're saying is that it's called Project Battle, and it's a Capcom-themed action card game. I'm pretty sure that's, that's all that the information from my, the, the guys at my talent agency that gave me this, that's all that they're saying. Rose made it in. Woo! Uh, Nello Angelo? Yeah, that is actually where you fight him, too. Cool. What is this? Oh, it's that creepy asshole from Devil May Cry 5! The guy that spins in the lightning shit. Okay. I don't like him. Dante looks good. Wait, did Anna Karras make it into this game? Oh my god, Anna Karras made it into this game! <sighs> they didn't forget. I'm sorry, four! Four, chat room. Yep, that's Morrigan being Morrigan, alright. This is, uh... This is Ryu's brother. Jim. They gave me the sweet lore ahead of time. There, and there's an Ada card. Cool. You're hiding Trish? Ada, wait! Dota stream win? I don't know what Dota is. Is that League of Legends? Dota lol? That's whenever I hear people talking about Dota, they say LOL after, so I'm assuming Dota and League are the same thing. Uh, Lilith. Chanko. Wow, Jester made it in. That's actually kind of cool. So it's not just DMC4. It's also going back to DMC3 and DMC2. Who the hell? This is some Mega Man stuff I am unfamiliar with. Chat room, you have to fill me in. As beyond my Capcom days. Nice. I'm gonna put these fingers right up your whoa. Whoa. Uh holy shit, that is a very cool picture of Uriel. Mega Man X8? Ooh. X8 was a little better than X7. Who the hell is this? The half-human, half-demon falls into darkness and discovers a new way to live his life? Is this Dimitri? Huh. Evil Donovan? Evil Dimitri? That's Donovan? How the hell? Have I never seen this before? Vamp Donovan, how funny. Anyway. Looks like there's a lot of, like, small character cards. Like just enemies and stuff. Ugh. Hey, no, wait! You know what's funny? They put Ada inside the RE4 castle, and I appreciate that. I appreciate that it's RE4 Ada. Yeah, dude, there's enough art in this game to fill an entire book. Like one of those Capcom art books, there's enough. Holy hell. Neat. Is that a DMC5 transformation? No. DMC5 is way more... spiky. Boomer Quanger, yeah. Where are you, base? I'll check this out. If I, if base, if I, if I do see base in here at some point, I'll do it for you. 
Is that the balcony that overlooks the maze? I'm pretty sure that's what they're going for right there. This is the maze area. Cute. Cute little reference. Victor! Why isn't it- why isn't it his butt cheek grab? It should be his butt cheek grab. Sick. Yeah, I don't actually- it's all been Mega Man X so far. I haven't seen any traditional Mega Man. So it's not been classic Mega Man, it's all been this stuff. Wait a minute, is this literally burned to the ground? Is this burned to the ground? Burned to the ground? Ugh. Does this thing look headless? What the hell am I looking at? Oh god, get it away. That's Magma Dragoon? Magma Dragoon's the good one. He's the one that has, like, literally Shore Yukons and stuff. That's a cool shot. Morrigan's butt? The card? Man. Murdered all those guys. There's a video game in here eventually, chat room, I swear to god. I swear that there's eventually a video game in, our, in here, beyond all this presentation and artwork. Somewhere, we're gonna find the game. We're gonna find it. We have plenty of time, though. My soul is calling for more power. Heating the call. The power slumbering in the devil's blood begins to stir. Alright. If there... I'm gonna say it right now. If there is a Cyber Akuma card, I'm turning off the stream. If there's a Cyber Akuma card, I will turn off the stream. I'll turn it off. I'm gonna end it. it looks very Street Fighter 4-ish. Remy's in the game, what? <laughs> Remy, you look really out of place everywhere you go. Because you're a KOF character in a Capcom game, man. Jai... Gypseros? Weird poison mob. Oh, she's doing her uppercut, that's cool. <gasps> Damn! We found Morgan Butt, card two. Kamosi. Dante talking smack. Uh, Utsu semi technique. That's cool. Holy hell! Oh my god! Nobody tell Steven about this. Holy shit! <laughs> I mean, he still got his green his green hoots, but nobody tells nobody tell Steve about this. Nobody tell Steve that this exists. Don't do it. Steve's gonna come busting through my door. Want to make a zero deck? That's Tigrix, all right. Yeah, I've been. I was dealing with that over the weekend. The great baggy. Yeah, that zero does look pretty sick. I don't know how you build decks, but I'm hoping you can like the way you can build decks is. You know what? Actually, that makes more sense because now I'm looking at it. These are all in like the shadow. Like whatever this whatever this deck is, and then Ryu's got the fire deck. So I think you can only use fire cards on a fire deck because obviously this deck has this. Maybe, maybe that's why there's multiple character cards all over the place. That would make a lot of sense. Dark li li libido, the dark libido. <laughs> uh. That sounds about right. That's what they called you in chat room. I'm sorry. That's what they called you in high school chat. <laughs> That's what they called you in chat room high. Dark libido. <laughs> so chat, how how many semesters did you get held back in chat room high? You got to tell me. How long did it take you to get through chat room high? 3 years, 4 years? <laughs> Chat room high. Um, she'd be the same person. Damn, Morgan's got a lot of cards in here, dude. They gave her a ton. Dark libido. <laughs> that is a cool shot of Dante. Damn, that is a really cool shot of Dante. I always did like Dante's Devil May Cry uh, 
4 costume. I thought it was the best one. Now that Devil May Cry 5 is out, DMC 5 is way better. Because they feared our potential. <laughs> I remember this dickhead from DMC 3. Wow, Colleen's in the game. So even more Street Fighter 5 characters have made it in. Huh. I failed the backseating class. Well, chat, all of you did. All right, there's never been someone that's good at backseating. It's never happened. Everyone failed that class. Even care? Rose is holding tarot cards in her... Is that a... Uh, I don't know. Rose looks very Street Fighter 4-ish. I don't know if that's a hint towards Street Fighter... Uh, more Street Fighter stuff in the future. Zero's having a bad day. Uh, Dung Bomb! I'm gonna make my Dung Bomb build! My Dung Bomb deck! Uh... Cool. What am I fighting for? Damn, Shenko looks awesome. So yeah, I am seeing some repeat cards because... I think they're in different classifications, like... This is for the purple deck stuff. Oh, shit. Uh, Zenojiva looks nuts. As he slams the ground, then everything explodes, and everyone gets hit no matter what. So there's a bunch of Monster Hunter World stuff in here. Ooh, Jesus. Oh, God. About to be murdered. Wesker, you murdered Spencer! And he's happy about it. He's super thrilled. Inheriting ambition. One demon card or whatever the hell this is. Okay. Demon drug! I'm gonna get crazy on this juice! <laughs> is this... No. Did they put a Code Veronica card in here? No. They did. That is that is Code Veronica, isn't it? Oh my god. Selfish predation. This is badass. It should be called Turf War. Jeez! Uh, okay. I don't have no idea who this is. I have... Big Capcom fan. No clue. Lord Bibson. This reminds me a lot of, like, the 90s trading card games. Like, it reminds me a lot of, um... When I used to collect those old Marvel trading cards and stuff. Like, the art art style is very similar. Oh, wow. That's Steve. Wow. Steve Burnside... ...made it into this damn game. Wow. I mean, spoilers, chat room, but that's what happens to Steve. Hmm. Oh, shit. Alright. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. There's a lot of Arkham in here. DMC4, last boss? R. Lento. Total butthead. Basic ass zombie. Basic ass Anjanath. Pyron! How long is this thing? Oh my god, we're almost done. There's so many damn cards, dude. That's Mundus? Wait, what? Did I miss something? Does this game matter as a preview? This is this is specifically a preview. It's in in development preview. Oh, that's awesome. Cute. The specific RE2 zombies. You're Mundus chat. Cinder. <laughs> right. Erkin.
Wait, what? What am I looking at? A boy turned into a grotesque mutation in order to survive, but for this man, he was more than a precious sample. Oh, RE1 stuff. Who the hell? Oh, Smegma. That's Smegma. Yeah, Odegar and chomping down. Are these the scissor monsters? They are. <clears throat> Lord Raptor going in once again. Vile. The bounty hunter. Vile is so the Boba Fett of Mega Man. No Resident Evil Code Veronica stuff. No, we saw Code Veronica stuff. We literally saw Code Veronica, Claire, and Steve post-transformation. That was in there. You know what I haven't seen, though? I'm seeing a lot of similar theming stuff in here between, like, yeah, Darkstalkers, Devil May Cry, Mega Man, Monster Hunter, you know, yada yada. But I haven't seen a lot of one-off characters. I haven't seen, like, a Captain Commando. Or stuff like that. No Asura's Wrath? Nothing, nothing yet. Oh, man. oh my god. Oh my god. No Animusha? Yeah, not yet. We're not done yet, though. I am still seeing new characters, like Sodom is in here. He's got his Alpha 2 proportions. No Aliens versus Predator? Not yet. We shall see. They put a hunter in here. I can see light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah, chat room. Somewhere there's a video game in here, and I think we're almost there. Uh, okay, hunk. Oh, Seth is in here. Is that Tyrant as well? Yes, it is. Cute. Well, it looks like the stream is going to continue because I don't think I haven't seen one Akuma and I have seen no Cyber Akuma. Cool. No Tofu? Yeah. Maybe that's maybe that's the areas that they'll expand. Maybe we'll get Tofu and classic Mega Man and stuff like that. It's kind of awesome. Gotta unlock, maybe, I don't know, I don't know how much of the game is unlocked in this preview build, I'm assuming there's, it's a lot. That's awesome, holy shit. I'm assuming there's a lot, like a lot of these cards are naturally unlocked because it is a pre-release like build. Val Hazak? I wanna see more animated cards, dude, holy hell. And that's the end. And that is the end. This, this bison card is apparently ridiculous. Um, there is an all tab. There is an all tab. But I think we've seen all these. Is there any way I can look up, like, deck limit, filter, legendary? Uh,. Huh. Where is... Yeah, there's a search button at the bottom. I mean, I got that. Hold on a second. Secret Legendary. No, I didn't think that would... Secret? Oh, there you go. So yeah, these were the four that were animated. There was only four, like, animated cards, so I'm assuming there's gonna be a lot more of these. Um... Okay. All right, legendary. Uh, I did. These look really damn cool. Like, I hope that there's more stuff like this because this is kind of awesome.